Hello and welcome. Right, we are, yeah, we've got the, I put the shovel down. I have, I've put a bit of a move around. Yeah, I've got the John Deere's implements down. I've stuck the lime in one over here. And yeah, let's just get this, the front loader bin up a bit on and the weights, which I believe the weights are over here. Yeah, I thought what we'd do is start by grabbing the stones off the field. Yeah, rather than forgetting it, because I know what I'm like. The amount of times on the uh, <laughs> riverside and other let's plays, I just leave the stones for quite a while. So I thought, let's not, let's not do that. Let's just get cracking and sort that. Oh, that thing keeps on dropping down. Yeah. And yeah, we do need to drop you there. You will do nicely. Thinking this should do nicely, but now then, which one do we? Yeah, I'm also, also going to stick those down. So let's grab this. We'll take the big sin track, Mr. Thirsty. Yeah, I'm thinking this should actually manage it. It's only just two and a half odd tons. I think we'll be alright. It's a long. It is. To be honest, I prefer the Bandarante for little tractors. Because it's its reach is about perfect for small to medium tractors. Yeah, it's not very long, whereas that's quite long really for that. Right, let's stick this straight in its proper shed over there. Yeah, this was actually specially for this grass stuff, and I don't think still that we are going to uh, manage to do the biggie. I think that's, as I said, really going to have to stick outside. But we can stick the mower combination. Yeah, I do also agree with what I was saying. When you consider you uh, could... Well, could you? No, no, you'd, you wouldn't be able to stick the windrow on with any other combination. No, I am wrong. Oh, actually, ooh, I don't know that you are, because we've only got the 10 metre size. This actually might do. Wow. Yeah, I think we're going to have to let go of the baler first and stick it in sec 238 bales. Remember, it takes an age to let go. So, you know, for once, this is the high shed. I do like this one. And I did hope that it would work, but I didn't think it would. But I think we can all see that that's actually going to nicely fit underneath there. So, yeah, we're, I, I'm liking our yard. I am. Now, the baler can go on the outside, really, under the overhang. Although... I think this baler deserves its place, really. I'm very pleased with this baler. It was very reasonable, and it's done as proud. Apart from the, the Mack Trucker didn't like it. That, that's one thing I'm going to say. The Mack Trucker didn't like it at all. Oh, do you know something? I think, I think we can, uh, yeah, get that 1%. I didn't realise that was so close before. And we will... Uh, I should have put it straight in the oven tunnel, but it is a long way for it to run, so, you know, yeah, we'll grab it and sort of switch that off and lift it as well. We don't want that trailing on the ground. We can stick that sort of. They don't have to quickly. If you think Windrow is a bad bait, it's even worse. As I always say about Windrow as being the worst, but actually, Baylor's a, that, that one especially because it's so small. Right, smashing, sorted. Right, so let's grab a trailer that will accept stones. Now, I think the farm tech is bulk materials, but I know that the big one is, although I'm trying to stay clear of using that, it is heavy. It really is very heavy. So I'm hoping farm tech. Well, we're going to find out in a minute if we can grab all that stone off. And we are down to oh yeah, my bad. I must have double pressed it. Yeah, I'm liking where we are all oh, my life. How, Mr. Greedy, Gordon Bennett. We only filled you a couple of sessions ago, or a session ago, I think. Yeah, wow. Now, the, yeah, a couple of times I, I thought it was myself, but it isn't. It, there's been a couple of times on sessions that I've filled like a diesel tank with, uh, you know, like some, uh, and then the next session it's all gone. Now that that was okay. It is true, and I have noticed that it, yeah, where I thought, oh, I've done that, and then it's disappeared. Now then, uh, yeah, well, I think what we're going to do is 
No, we'll just go to the lumps with this and then we're going to grab the... Uh, we should already put the other on, follow me. And then we could have hopped out. A sensible person would have probably done that. Really, we've also got to look when is it that we are... Yeah, because uh, this crop calendar, this particular one, is really throwing me out. Because, uh, yeah, you do get used to the crop calendar. And now, all of a sudden, I really... It's just like I'm going back to learning all over again. Because it's... Uh, I, I mean, it's yeah, it's not awful, but... Right. Where are we? Yeah, that's the one. And let's reset that. I want the shop as our point. See, and let's see how well this does. Isn't this the high tip? Didn't we go for the high tip in the end? No, we didn't. No. Uh, I thought we did. I thought we paid a lot of money because it was the high tip. I could have sworn I did. But that, it's not a high tip. Hang on a minute, hang on a minute. That looks like a high tip to me. It does. Yeah, just just a little old me forgetting the uh, configurations, as I do frequently. I do things like that, yeah, where it's not something you use very often. Um, obviously, high tips a bit of a luxury and yeah we could afford it I mean we are really seriously going down the money now uh, but again with December have we got no I think we did everything didn't we that's why we sold everything earlier we spent it as soon as we'd as, yeah, as soon as we'd earn it right so then what have we got we haven't we have pretty much sold everything that we have got I believe we said oh that there was an awful lot of fertilizer to do that is going to sell. Yeah, that I, I think if we remember, it's not in there yet because the manure and the digestate are both in ready. That I think there were a hundred odd tons in both, really. Um, ish, uh, I think I'm right in saying that. Yes, I am pretty much. Yeah, there's a hundred and odd tons of digester and almost a hundred and odd tons or ninety odd tons of manure. So that's going to be almost two hundred tons of um, fertilizer that we should make overnight, or at least a goodly amount of that. Now, then, can we cope with that weight? Stones are very, very dense, so I'd rather, if it was anything else, you might get away with it. Oh, 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 oh my life what what is that about why are we sinking into the ground what is that about it's like the ground is, is, is like yeah sinking all my life okay I don't know that that's anything to do with that. I, it's like almost... Wow. Okay. <laughs> that's different. Very, very different. Yes, I was determined. I was going to come on here and we... Uh, so we will see what tomorrow brings. I think I'm right. Uh, we're going to go through... Well, actually, it's the summer. But there's nothing we can actually sow just yet, if I remember rightly. I was almost 100% sure that the... Now we can. It's in, But it's in March. So really, we've got to go through what in Britain we would consider the winter. Yeah, we have really. Now that you've done it, now you, you've already done that. Now let's see if we can actually... Yeah, this is a bit strange. Really strange. You can sort of lean against something like that. Oh, I have said this before. And yeah, then you can sort of like lean more than you really would. And then if we can remember that configuration, we should be able to use that beautiful thing, that otherwise known as a high tip. I do like this. I do. I'm glad I'm using this again. Yeah, because I say I did uh, grab it out of the my mods for a while and then I saw it had got another update and I thought, Do you know, I really like it. I could see that a lot of work had gone into it. It just wasn't working properly uh, when I last used it and that's about right. It is, we don't want any more than that. Yeah. 
short. Yeah, it's doing something weird again on that right hand side. Very strange. Very, very strange. Is it too much weight? See, let's do a little less and just see. That, yeah, let's be very scientific about this. Let's grab about 1500 litres. Apologies. I'm just having a quick chat with my daughter who's just got back from work at this late hour. Yeah, this is, yeah, this is less. This is nearly a tonne. So I thought, in fact, actually, I think this is all of this. Well, no, no, not quite. I could have probably actually done all of that. Yeah, I think this is going to be a lit. Well, we can take it to the next pile, really. It could have been that. That's a bit weird, but it could be the edge of the field as well. It is a little bit odd. So, yeah, it's. It is a new map, as I said, although most of the things so far that I've leveled at the map have actually been down to the uh, crop calendar being... Right, let, let's yeah, let's add the Sintrack to follow. Why am I not going forwards? Yeah, there's uh, three or four piles at the very least, and we can stick these in and we can make some lime, which we ran out of last session. So, yeah, that's a... Uh, I've noticed this is popping a lot quicker. Yeah, it really is. Right, yeah, I'm going to go just around the edge of the field. Well, it's... It, yeah, I mean, stones are very dense, so it's not about... Well, it is about weight. They are very heavy for what they are. It's true. Uh, yeah, I think I can see some. It just shows up as a bit of a blob in the distance until you get closer, so... Ooh, syntrax has been a little bit slow. So I think we're going to aim for about a ton and a half. And then we're going to go through, I think, yeah, we're going to go through what, what would be the winter in Great Britain, but which really isn't. Oh, oh, that's about right, I should say. Let's grab you. Right, smashing, and we'll stick you here. There's another couple of piles. Oh, wow, that's more than I thought, actually. I, mean, I think I said about 10 tonnes. Between 7.5 and 10 tonnes, I think, is what my guesstimate was. So, yeah, I think that's not going to be far off. Yeah, oh, we just had a bit of a tick up at 1 o'clock. We were on 140-something, I think. Or were we on 170? It's gone down, I'm not sure. I am not sure. I do love this, it really does give the front loaders a little bit of a, a lift up really with things like this which are really a bit of a stretch for them with such a high sided, uh, yeah, high -sided um, I was going to say vehicle but yeah, trailer. Yeah, the, I went on Agres, I've got, um, yeah I'm on Agres and Yarra Valley at present I'm hoping to get back to doing some but with my little bit of a health scale which I'm not I'm not trying to yeah go on about but just making you aware because I do I feel a bit like I've let you down but I also know you would probably all understand in the circumstances of why I have not been doing those particular let's plays so I am hoping to crack on and yeah that I've always have two minds whether it does make any difference at all the size of a let's play because you've always only got you can only do so much but I think it does play on your mind sometimes when you're yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna say when you're little yeah well when you feel like that that's yeah that's you're not little but yeah we all have those times where wow that is really really kicking quickly yeah now we can usually see it start to appear as a, like a blob of grey in the distance with the draw thing and then it's a big, it is a big field, These, we have gone for big fields, I've got to be honest. Yeah, they, they are big, and I am seriously wondering whether we do go, I mean, because really, I don't know, we, we do need to go big as well, in so much as, yeah, once you've done a, fit, a big field, it is only the harvest then, we may well have to go for uh, more harvesters, yeah. 
or big uh well, it is a big one isn't it the, it's the john deere we've got on this and we i always get confused yeah he's i'm thinking of agris we've got the one of the dominators dropped uh what it really is a starter harvest whereas this really is not a starter harvest it's quite a oh 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 let's tip a little bit out i don't think yeah that will do oh i picked it straight up again would you believe it i would that's it that that's that'll do nicely i think this is the last pile though but then we did say seven and a half to ten tons so we shall see yeah, so yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, I think I was not far off. So, let's have a look how much. Yeah, we just saw two tons, so that would be nine and 9.4 tons in total ish. So, I think we were, we're not far off. It's still quite a bit on the floor. Although, I always find that quite. So, uh, it's a little bit not as much as you think. Right, okay. Yeah, I think 1.5 tons of stone is about right. Yeah, I might also be doing a little bit of a, um, a off series about um, settlers, the latest settlers. Now, I've, I've yeah, I, I know I've only ever done um, this particular game as for content but i played settlers ever since settlers one which is a just in the i think it was 1998 or it was about 2000 something like that i, I think it was about the mid turn of the millennium which is 20 odd years so if anything really i've been playing this game about three years and that one about 20 odd at least 20 so yeah if anything you could say that i've played through all of the settlers games yeah, through all of the good and the bad, yeah, because the, the, I did always think that uh, um, Blue Bite had sort of gone against their own, what they'd set up as settlers. Now, I know you've got to have some changes because some people uh, want something different. Right, let's, yeah, let's put this on, on uh, follow. We'll have a very quick look to see how much we did actually get in the end. Oh, nearly 10 tons. Yeah, smashing. All right, let's take this and stick it in, and we will make a bit of lime. I've got quite a bit because it double. I am right. It like doubles. It's almost like one and a quarter, not one point five times, but one and a quarter times. I think is about right. Now that we ought to be as well as we did last time. We ought to be jumping out and regularly doing this. And then you also press fill, so it's ready to fill next time. I do love doing that, it's quite amazing, really. Right, let's, let's, yeah, let's get cracking. So, we don't need to fertilize and line this field. Uh, does it grow anymore? It does, that's the bad side to this. It is. Do we? We haven't got the money, but we should have some money in the morning. It would be nice to fit the to stick the animals down. I'm not going to go massive. Yeah, I, I thought about that. I'm not going to go absolutely humongous, right? Or yeah, because it, it, we've got to juggle really everything. I, I'm going to do yeah because we are doing a lot of things. You've got to have some concessions, right? Yeah, I think oh, I left this here to show you. That's right. I remember, and, and that not so close to the great that Mr. Smith. Not the best for realism that you're always aiming for. So you say. I, no, I do. I do aim for and right. Yes, this also needs re refueling. I don't think this has been refueled at all, though. And this goes to show the difference between the Sin track and the other tractors. Yeah, it's true. Although, yeah, I mean, I suppose uh, the other. Yeah, I'm not sure that I know. We, I think we've used the two masses probably equally. So yeah, you're probably not all using. Whereas the Sin track, there's only one of him. Yeah, really. smashing let's make sure that is actually on I think we switched it on last session I'm sure I remember seeing that but just make sure no we didn't 
Is this the right one? It is. It is the right one. Have we got any water in? No, we haven't. So we're going to manually. Oh, that we'd have to. No, no, no. We've got the old one. We can stick the uh, the other twenty five tonner. Really, you don't have to do the. Uh, I do think as well. Now I know that the dist distribute to Biomatana is as good as it is. I'm th very old school, and you may have thought of it yourself. There was no need for me to put the distributor right next to the great things because yeah, it will distribute from anywhere. So really, I think that I've got to get better at designing my farmyards around the modern production way of doing things, really, because there's no real need to have this old school where it's right next to things. That That's old school. It is. You don't have to do that anymore. Right, now then, I don't think, no, we're not going to get in there. I think we do need another tap over this end anyway, so I think we'll stick another tap in, as you would. Yeah, let's face it, it's not going to break the bank to have another tap. Yeah, so the uh, new lime back is there, and it's got the big boom on itself. Yeah, we have got the John Deere. I thought we had. Right, so if we... Did we not? I thought we'd already stuck one in. No, I don't think we did. Well, I think we'll stick it next to... We're going to probably need to have to go into V mode. Please don't tell me I have stuck another one down already over this side. don't think so, do we? This is a new... Ooh, wow, it's 15 grand. It's a little bit expensive for... I mean, don't get me wrong, it's not like the little tap. And again, though, I suppose that's the advantage to little taps and things like that. Obviously, they wouldn't cost an awful lot, right? So let's sort of go here like that. Oh, now I know. Let's stick a blob of painting. We will go for that. And we're going to make it bigger like that. And then we are going to stick it down with V mode, I might add. Yeah, there is a place for the water tap. I do like to use new things, but it, the other thing is it's cost. A tap is not expensive, whereas a big water tower really would be. So it really is what... Yeah, let's stick V mode, and we don't want it too close. Uh, I would say that is about... Right, smash it. So if we reverse to that, it shouldn't get confused and mixed up with loading herbicide and all the liquids. The other thing is, I was yeah, I was thinking about this in the session. I do think, obviously, the trigger, you do go on the trigger, but I think when you've got liquids and solids, it almost treats it like two separate things. This should be enough, really, I think. I think, let's have a look. We have uh, how much... 10 tons of stone which would double which means it would 20 yeah we would double the amount basically for that so yeah i am right 25 tons would go to 50 tons so there's more than enough water in this this is a little bit temperamental actually because it's definitely clearly selected and it usually is that red thing at the back so i think i must be a little bit off I think I need to be a little bit further forward. Perhaps I'm too far back. Uh, this is a bit temperamental, the Quaco. Yeah, it's certainly not filled, filled, so did have weird problems when I had the other distributor as well. It, it also did strange things, but it really should. It's got the fill inside, so why can I not empty? Hang on a minute, is it what you were just talking about? Is that or the thing too close to the trigger? It may well be exactly what you thought it was. It could be, actually, thinking about it. 
you don't always think about game mechanics because in real life you wouldn't do things quite as they are but it could well be if that's on the trigger I've shown this on uh, lots of let's plays rom bars uh, yeah that you, if you have got something on the trigger it often does that where it won't let the trigger pop because something else has already got it on he's got to think of it as on and off yeah it's exactly that it was nothing to do with mod clashes just plain game mechanics it was so then I think we're gonna go through till tomorrow morning and then hopefully we shall have earned an absolute fortune from our fertilizer business really oh that's a little bit lopsided but hey ho it is what it is right so we should no we shan't pretend we're gonna put them out down we are Yeah, we're gonna, uh, hopefully it's not floating because sometimes it looks like it's down and it's actually floating. Agres, I'm sure it's a flying carpet. It looks okay. No, it, I think it is floating. <laughs> I think it's just, it is what it is. Yeah, and if you sometimes put, I tried this on um, one of the other oh, let's I can't think of its name. Thornton. Yeah, I put a, and it went did a weird thing. So let's have a look on the sails to see if anything else has popped. No, it's not exactly what it was. So sleep till nine o'clock because this is yeah. Although to be honest, no, I think we're going to sleep till eight o'clock because this is really summer. I, I, I've got to try and retrain myself as a a, a, a British person. That this your neck of the woods in Australia. Is completely different. Oh, very nice. Oh, my life. I was not kidding. I was, <laughs> I really was not kidding. Yeah, that is, that is a lot. Oh, hang on a minute. Is that field at the bottom? Is that ready? Oh, now that's a good one. It is for that. Seventy percent off. I think we will go for that. Definitely. <coughs> Seed treater, conveyor belts like this is able to produce seed directly from your grain trailer. Ah, it's nice to know, but we've already got that ability. So, do you know, and, and being as it's only seed that it can do, I think we'll pass. But yeah, so let's have a quick look. I think, and yes, if we press the right button, Let's have a look at, because I did say when the fields are available, which I believe field five is, and that is 272. I would like field three. I'm not sure about field eight. I think, we're, yeah, I don't want to make this massive. Uh, that That's the trouble. So I think actually two, seven, six, four, and five are probably enough. I did want three, but you know, it's a shame because three is a really good one. What is eight, five like? Oh, it is a good one. It's yeah, mostly loam, so it's thirty, yeah, sixty-six percent, really. So I think let's just check, make sure it is. It's definitely cultivating. So let's buy it right now. Fantastic, excellent. Right. So then I think. Let's have a look at our productions and see because everything should be sort of over the winter looking after it's where well, it's not the <laughs> will you stop saying over the winter it's not uh lime there's only 23 tons are we going to buy some more stone because we that, that's not going to touch anything we've just seen with what we got rid of before how wow why is that why is that not going down very much uh, or is it that yeah I think you'll find it's also that the grass in in that yeah there's every oh it's 31 tons of silage still it would have been the grass so there's a lot of grass in there there was yeah it's still yeah of course there was yeah 400 and odd tons so there's another massive payout as well so yeah right okay in that case do we Let's have a look at all of our other businesses too, just so you can all see how we're doing. 
I do think I am right though, but, but yet yeah, one thing at a time. Yeah, that's nice. 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 Excellent. Silage we've just seen. The olive oil is olives 15 tons. That's nearly done. And that yeah, the pig food's going back up the olive oil. Oh, hang on a minute, we've got that on selling now. Oh no, no, that is right. Yeah, that, I'm quite happy to keep that selling, truthfully. All of it, yeah, really. It, it's it's all going to just give us a massive hit all of the time, including that as well. Raisins, that's the one. That Why is it that's got a low priority of one and it's still filling that up with grapes? And the other one, it isn't filling very much at all. It's either priority's not working properly. Yeah, because this is hardly getting any grapes in at all, and that's got a priority of 10. And we're definitely trying to call for it. So, yeah, it's got zero. So that's that's a bit of a strange one. Right, anyway, do we switch that off for, just to, does it to, yeah, to reset the, we could try that. We could actually try that to reset the priorities to see if it has got anything whatsoever to do with the original Yarrow one which maybe because it's a map based one might actually take precedence anyway so if we stick raisins off because of all of the things we've got that really is yeah if we switch that off and which hopefully that will reset and things will settle down so we've got all of that done we've bought another field we will. We, no, there's, there's no point. It doesn't really matter. It's March is the important month, so we're going to sleep straight through again. We've got all of our productions sorted that can be, and we. I was going to do the animals. Yeah, but I'm happy. And now I know that we should have another massive payout. Truthfully, again, we've worked with our partners, and we have done a lot of work. It with the grass that was a lot of grass there. I remember that is true that is two sleeps how is the grass doing oh wow I did we cut the other one the month before I think it was all on the same month so if I'm honest this should be just the same second growth stage I think Yeah, it is. You, you, you can see by the colour from all this distance that it's not that lush green at all. So, wow, I can't get over how... Uh, well, I can. And I know... And, yeah, I can see the green in the corner. Let's have a look. Another one of those. Uh, uh, well, it might, I think it's a different one. I think it is. This is a lizard. It is. Right, smashing. So then I think we can now afford our animals. Let's have a bit of fun. Yeah, let's uh, get this sorted, I think. We've got water now this close, and we've also got, we can buy, do we do some mixing ourselves with the Omatana and stick by the stuff and mix it separately rather than just buy it straight off? I think I also, right, yeah, let's, let's have a bit of fun. Let's try and design our farmyard. I did also, I was thinking about this, of mixing the um, the shed. Though that is, has become one of my favourites, but it doesn't doesn't ensconce my black sheep modern one. Oh, no, I won't have ticked it. I, I, I loaded a Brazilian shed pack, which I really quite like the look of. Sometimes I like to feature new mods, but I haven't ticked it. So let's do my absolute favourite. Do you like these ones as well? The uh, the large shed with the, uh, large sheds with the overhanging bits, because these are my type of sheds where they've got the yeah a lot of big spaces in between, and it's not a bad price. So you've got the big bit of the shed in there, and then you've got the little overhanging bits there. That's so that's one to consider. And there are a few different designs. I like the open ones. I'm a bit of a fan. Not only for the fact that... Oh. Wow. I didn't know about that one. That is amazing. Amazing value. 
It's a little bit different to this particular pack, but it's still a Bernie. Wow, okay, well, that's one to consider. But the one I really want to do is, I do would like to do my Black Sheep Modding one as well, if we can, if it will work. Uh, no, it's not that one. It's that one there, and it's not about the money. So we're trying to think about this. I was thinking, obviously that section that is over there is the bit where you have your implements. I love those base. You could, I mind you, you block the overhang then. It, I mean, the best way to do this is like that, where you do it like as a but your bays need to be on this side yeah they are and the pass through section then would go let's try and do it from this side where we can see what we're doing and it wouldn't matter that you were I, I don't think that's bad are we taking away space I've probably again this is what I was saying about English Things you don't want it to be too cluttered, so I would sooner have this close but not too close because then I'm defeating my own sort of thing that I always talk about. I do you think we want to landscape that and we want to use the same painting, which I believe is that one? It is, yeah. I don't want different, uh, isn't this asphalt? It is. Always find this difficult to do this, I suppose. Yeah, it's. Ooh. Right. I was thinking, we are. Are we going to do. I think we'll do one thing at a time. I think we'll. Uh... Or do we just go for one? Do we just go. I think sheep are a massive thing in Australia. It used to be one of those things that are often featured, although so are steers as well, so are yeah, like cows, so I don't know, we could do I did I've done pigs recently on Horsh. Yeah, literally. I was quite pleased with that actually. I was. And out for the very first time ever I actually did things what I consider the proper way. Um I think that's not bad. Right, okay, so now we need to go animals. We may go. Uh, I've got to be honest, I always find sheep are very, very little work. I think we'll go. A small, that's 80. Puma, 250. That is a really large one. Is it the. I th was it the Sosnovka? Sos Sosnovka one or something like that. Extra large. Ah, fluffy mods. 250. S extra large sheep pasture. Does that? No, it's sheep. It really. Oh, it says water. I mean, it requires water. So does that. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you're going to stick with me on this journey. And as always, as fellow shareholders on the farm, I always love to hear from you. And goodbye for now.